we're going to show the Russian version of how to, we're going to try and replicate how the Russians actually cut a bottle in half. So what we need is a blowtorch, which is here, a bottle with water in it up to the bottom of the label, a tin container, some oil, and some water. Nothing has happened. I repeat, nothing has happened. The bottle is still intact. We're now going to try a chisel. You can cut till it gets red hot. Chisel, you dizzle. It's a chisel. A chisel. Will it be a fizzle? You put your finger on it and, and I gave the, the uh, finger test. It's hot. It's red hot. Here we go. What is going on? I don't understand this. It's not working. Now they did use a jar, didn't they? We haven't got any jars, have we? Okay, it has to work with a bottle. Ah! Cut! Cut! <laughs> Film me. Film it. Ready to go now? Ready. Go. Put the very tip in. Okay. Let's have a look. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Fail! Russians, you have failed! That jar you've got in there must be made of, I don't know. It smells like apple cider, to be <laughs> honest. <laughs> so that concludes hazanow.com. Has it uh, concludes that the apple doesn't fall far from the, the bullshit that the Russians are exactly. coming up Russian with. Russian failure on normal bottles. I'm sorry, I cannot recommend that's how to cut a glass bottle. Well, maybe only Russians can do this. Maybe only Russians can do this. We don't have that power. Thank you, cameraman. Okay, this is hazanow.com, over and out. We gave it a try. We uh, used all kinds of things, tools. I'm sure we did it uh, pretty close to the way they do it. Uh, what, what do they say on Mythbusters? Myth? Busted. Busted.